Hey, if you're new here, consider subscribing. I do giveaways on pretty much every single video I do for my subscribers, and if you guys want some free Robux, or if you guys just want to enter into a giveaway, definitely feel free to subscribe, turn on those post notifications, and leave a big thumbs up on today's video. This video is going to be awesome, guys. I hope to see you there. And of course, these are some of the winners that have recently won Robux. Huge shoutouts to all of you guys for entering. We're getting tons of entries every single day, and I'm more than happy to give to the community that is watching my videos, so thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to watch the whole video and leave this video a big thumbs up. I really hope you guys do enjoy it. This one is awesome. Now let's get into the video. Roblox has now introduced star codes. All you guys got to do is type in my name matrix just before you guys purchase Robux. Thank you so much everyone. Today is the day we are finally becoming Dragon Masters. Guys, welcome back to a brand new Ninja Legends video today on the channel. I hope you guys are all in great spirits. Today is the second video of the day. And I just want to say right away, thank you all so much for all the support on the first video we uploaded today. I really appreciate it. Guys, that was my biggest giveaway ever. Go check that video out if you haven't already. I'm giving away 50 game passes in that video. Today, don't worry. We still got another giveaway planned. And uh, by the end of today, I will make sure to get all the winners their Robux. It just, it takes a long time to send it all out. Just because obviously I have like, after today, there's going to be about 60 winners. Okay, so it's going to take a little while to send it all out. But don't don't worry, you will get your Robux if you guys win. However, we're gonna get into this video and we are gonna get into all the cool stuff we're gonna do, especially becoming a Dragon Master. Now, before we do that, I will go ahead and do the giveaway. So again, today is going to be another giveaway. I, on the other video, am giving away 50 of the plus two pet slots game passes. If you want that, check that video out. But today we are going to give away in this video 10 of these plus 200 capacity uh, pet game passes. 10 of them today. If you guys want to be a part of that giveaway, you know what to do. Most of you do. If you're new here, make sure you guys subscribe and turn on that bell. New people watching this video, if you're not subscribed yet, you have to be subscribed to win free game passes, okay? And I want you to win because if you're watching this, it takes three seconds to hit that sub button and to turn on that bell. Three seconds and you guys can go ahead and win some free Robux. But with that being said, everybody, leave a like on today's video, smash that like button. We're going to go ahead and do more videos on this game. You already know that. And of course, we're going to do more giveaways as well. So that being said, everybody, head into the comments, send your Roblox username, and I will send out some Robux to 10 of you. With that being said, guys, we are going to jump right into this. And so as you can see here, I have this cool aura around me. I've always had that as a dragon warrior, but you can kind of tell something's off here. Where is my weapons? Well, let me tell you. Once you get further into the progression, you actually stop getting weapons. Let me show you what I mean. We're going to go to the newest area, which is the thunderstorm, and I'll show you guys exactly what I'm talking about because inside of the thunderstorm, in thunderstorm shop, you go all the way down, you guys will see at a certain point, you don't get these scythes anymore. You actually start to unlock these these are different ninja forms and as you progress here there's hunter forms and then at the very end there is dragon forms you guys can see I've got the maximum dragon form and uh, it's pretty cool so you guys can see here we're actually training martial arts from now on and we're not using weapons at all so we're getting a ton of ninjutsu especially because it's the two times weekend we're getting so much more ninjutsu and it is just OP with that being said guys this on top of the times 10 coins has already got us ready for the next rank okay let me show you I've clicked for about what maybe five seconds let's go sell and look how much OC we get out of that 30 OC just from a couple of clicks this is super super strong but either way let me show you guys the dragon master okay if we scroll down here this is the dragon warrior and then this is the Dragon Master. He gets a times 850 ninjutsu bonus at the cost of 350 OC. It's expensive. It's very, very expensive, but well worth it. So we're going to get into that, guys. I am super hyped about it. And then we're going to progress through and kind of just get an idea at how OP this really is. So that being said, guys, let's buy it. Let's get started. And uh, now we are at the very beginning once again. But as you can see, my aura has changed. It's not golden or orange anymore. It's like a rainbow color. So that's pretty cool. Um, but now let's just go sell. This is going to be very, very quick. Very, very fast. Um, I don't even need to buy that. All I need to do is buy more skills. And everybody in the chat is saying congratulations. Thank you to everybody. I appreciate it. We're just on my private server right now, which if you guys decide to become a sponsor of the channel, you guys will be on my friends list and can always, always 
join these VIP servers and play with me whenever I'm playing just for the fun of it. So if you guys want that, definitely feel free to, but um, did I not buy the skill? Hold on a second. Oh, I bought all the shurikens. That's what I just bought. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the newest shuriken uh, that I believe just came out, the explosive dragon shuriken. This is actually really cool. I was going to do a video on this, so I'm glad we didn't buy it just yet. Oh man, I bought the wrong thing. Are you kidding me? Okay, that's all right. We spent just a little bit of cheese, so it's not a big deal, I guess. Um, okay, I keep forgetting. I gotta actually do this first. Oh man, okay, so this is gonna be kind of a pain in the butt, but that's okay. I'm gonna do this kind of just fast. I'll do a little time lapse here, and I'll meet you guys when we are at the new island. Alright, sweet. So we've made it to the next island. We're just gonna keep progressing. I'm not gonna buy any weapons because at this point we already have so much money just from a few clicks. Um, but one thing I have noticed actually, and this is kind of a cool fact just to kind of talk about here uh, for those of you who are interested. So apparently because of all the duping of pets people have been duplicating their pets like crazy recently something has changed in uh, in ninja legends essentially what has changed is from now on players will not be able to uh, trade in vip servers because apparently that's where all the duping is happening now the problem is uh obviously people who like to play on vip servers like myself i won't be able to trade with you guys any of my pets on these servers and the problem there is that i did a giveaway last weekend where i was giving away a ton of immortal pets you guys loved it we had like two or three thousand people watching and you guys were participating and enjoying it a lot and the thing is now that I can't trade pets and VIP servers I won't be able to host any more of those pet giveaways so I guess it makes sense to protect the game and not to have like so many duplicated pets everywhere but at the same time it sort of sucks for the people who didn't do anything wrong and now we kind of have to deal with it so uh, you know it is what it is but I thought I would just let you guys know about that because it kind of does hinder my ability to do some live streams but with that being said, you know, it's not the end of the world and it does make sense and I understand where they're coming from. Obviously duplicating is bad and whatever they can do to fix that does make sense. So with that being said, you know what? It's okay. We'll figure something out around it. But for now, I'm just going to keep on parkouring here. I'm almost there. I'm, you know, almost at the Tundra Island after I get to the space one. So we're getting there. This is the one point in the game where I've heard people kind of complain is they want to progress and they want to keep ranking up, but they don't want to have to keep doing the parkour. And I figure, you know, it's not that much effort just to go to the next area. So like, look at this. We're already halfway there and it's only taken a few minutes. So you know, if they got rid of this and made it so you can just teleport even after you rank up, I think it would be kind of too easy. So I get it. It's fine with me. But yeah, I'll see you guys when we're at the top here and uh, we'll see what we can buy. I feel like we should buy more pets. I'll show you what pets I have. Um, but with that, we'll also go ahead and try to see how much money we can make because with all these new multipliers, I bet it's going to be kind of crazy. So I'll see you guys in a moment. So we're at the Tundra Island. That didn't take long at all. Um, but yeah, let's keep moving. This is honestly not that bad. Oh snap, I can't even go to the next area yet. I actually have to do some work, oh no. Um, I have to go ahead and click a few times, then we'll just sell. And, uh, oh man, I'm actually gonna have to buy some weapons here. Okay, here we go. And now that we click, we will have plenty. <laughs> yeah, there we go, that's that's more than enough. So we finally made it to the sandstorm area. And uh, with that being said, this is going to be the hardest part of the entire video. Making it up this area, I've done it once before, I've shown you. This part is hard, okay? I'm genuinely being serious. This part is hard. Even people in my chat right now are talking about it. It is a challenging, challenging parkour, but we can do it. We will make it. I'll try to actually do it while recording so you guys can see. Um, because it's it's hard, man. I mean, it's it's a mix of the sandstorm clouds, like these ones right here, also and a mix of the eternal clouds as well. So they move and they explode faster than the ones in the sandstorm area do. So you know, it's gonna be, it's gonna be something. It's gonna be something for sure. Um, but I'm, I'm not too worried about it. I think we'll be okay as long as we focus and pay attention and everything. We should be fine. But, um, how come I can't buy these? What is going on? 250 QI. Wait, what? Oh man. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna have to grind a little bit to get up to the next area. So give me a second and, uh, and I'll see you guys when we're ready to go. Alrighty guys, we're ready to go now. So let's try this out. I'm gonna do this on video just so you guys can see. It is, uh, 
it isn't the easiest, that is for sure, because some, some of the clouds move, and then the other ones are just like these, and they explode so fast, and as you can see, the game just glitched itself out, and it didn't register that I landed on that cloud, so... It, the, the problem is, is that they explode so fast, and you can't actually sit there for so long, so it's hard for the game to register that you, you actually made it to that cloud, so... That's, I guess, the real challenge, is kind of playing with the game's mechanics. Like, even just touching the cloud makes it explode, so... It's, uh, yeah, it's not the easiest, man. It's, it's, it's really... I like it because it makes sense that it's getting this hard to get to the next area. It's sort of the point of the game to get harder as you play. Um, but at the same time, I don't really think that they can get much harder than this. This is pretty much as difficult as they should be able to make it, because after this, like, how are you, how is anybody gonna be able to get further? But yeah, they explode really fast, and they move a lot faster too, as you guys can see. The moving ones don't really bother me, because once you're standing on them, they don't continue to move, so you kinda get a break, but it's the ones that are exploding that are just, like, so stressful. And another thing, you don't see, like, literally any islands here. Like, there's, like, maybe three islands at the very top, and that's it. Everything else is either clouds that explode or clouds that are moving, so it's a challenge, but, you know, once you're there, you're there, and you don't really need to leave it, uh, because it's unlocked and you're good, so it's alright. I just hope that moving forward, they kind of find a new way to do this, because I think that if they continue to make it faster and harder, like, a lot of people aren't gonna be able to do it. And it's not really fair for people who are grinding, but again, I, you know, we'll see. We'll see what they do. Oh my gosh, that cloud is moving. Are you kidding me? Okay, this one shouldn't be moving. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Nice, 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 nice. But yeah, no, and look how high up it is too. You really have to, you really have to land a bunch of things, and if you mess up, you kind of have to start all over again. So, I'm gonna try my hardest not to mess this up, because I really don't want to have to do this again. That's why you guys can see I'm not really pushing myself. I'm kind of taking it one cloud at a time here. I mean, yeah, you guys kind of get the point now. This is how it is. It's challenging but not impossible so yeah with that being said guys i will uh i will complete this and i'll meet you guys at the top hopefully i don't mess up along the way but i'll see you guys in a second okay i think i might make it here i've got eight jumps seven six come on yeah we should be good we should totally be good here i think Whew, we made it guys we made it to thunderstorm island let's go okay so we are the max rank now we can go ahead and probably purchase all the max stuff here and uh, yeah we've done it guys we have done it here we are i hope you guys did enjoy this um i'm definitely gonna go ahead and grind this out probably just to just to get myself set up for the next you know update that's sort of what i did with this one is give myself some time to set myself up so i'm gonna grind this out for a while and uh, try to get the best pets and all that and we'll do a video on that but anyways guys make sure you enter the giveaways because these ones are pretty crazy this weekend i hope you guys did enjoy leave a big thumbs up if you did and i'll see you guys all in the next video take care everyone